News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Hi, everyone. On this fifth day of June, Basil Chapman here. I am the host of the Tiger Technicians Hour, coming up straight off to this Tiger Financial News midday update. And what a day. The Dow is up 957 points at 27,234. That is extraordinary. This is, a, remember that 200-period uh, moving average we were talking about at about 25,600? I said, let's see how we can go above that, whether it becomes a magnet where we can move up. Powers right through. This, look at this weekly leg C. And what I've been discussing for some time now is saying with the positions that for subscribers to my opening call, my daily newsletter, fortunately we got in at the low on the 23rd and we added on the way on the Dow. The big thing is how are those weekly charts going to be with all the long positions we have. Well, now it's telling us what happens today, which stocks are participating, which aren't. Has it now rotated through the whole cyclical sector? What is happening? We'll discuss that on my show coming up. Let's go. S&P right now is up also huge. The Dow is up 3.68%. The Dow is up 2.92%, up 90, 90 points at 3203. Uh, 3393 was the all-time high, and we're trading right now with a high of 3211. This is... Uh, this is really quite extraordinary. It's helping that the weekly chart extremely so, and the monthly chart is really improving. QQQ, one, two, three. The QQQ is right now, the index 100, lagging a little bit. It's only 1.86% up, up 434 because it led the way through. And now we're getting the rotation through the other sectors, up at 239.35, all-time highs. Hey, all-time highs, look at this, the comp index. A penny, a, 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 I think it's a point. 98.38 was the all-time high back in February. Today's high is 98.34. We're five points away from making an all-time high in the very broad index, the, the uh, composite index. Let's go to the IWM. Remember, the IWM was leading earlier in the week. Up again, 5.11%, up 740 at 152 in leg D, these Ds are going to be really important. What happens after that? But it can be really exciting because it could recycle up leg D in the, in the weekly chart. Gold is taking quite a hit. You can see why. There's no use going to gold now. There's no fear factor. Gold's down 45 at 1681. And the dollar is trying here to attempt some kind of a base formation in the 9650 area. Wow, there's a ton to talk about. The TLT is tanking. The TBT is soaring. Yields are going up. I'll be back. There's a lot to discuss. I'm coming back in a few minutes for the Tiger Technicians Hour. Check my newsletter, the opening call. Check it out this weekend. There'll be a lot going on. Thanks for being here.